What is up everyone? Welcome back to some Black Ops 3 Custom Zombies map. I am going to replay this map as you've seen in a previous video. This one is kind of brutal as you have to get to the end and it gets crazy because it gets stressful. And it, it's a hard map, surprisingly. It, it's harder than I expected when I first played, so I am coming back. I'm going to see if I can beat this map. It is fun because it is very reminiscent of like old World at War challenge maps, especially like the original Cheese Cube Unlimited like tower map. And it's fun. It's it's fun in a challenging way. But we're going to try this. Um, I don't think I'm going to do the Rampage Inducer though. I don't know if that's... I still don't know how that works in this other than it just makes them all fast from the start. But I don't know. So I definitely I definitely want to get a quick revive. Because I I will die probably at some point. Not bad. And dying is pretty easy because you can literally fall off the platform and fall clear into the water and you're dead. That's it, you're dead. Alright, so round two zombies are done now. So I guess kind of the key to this is getting up to the pack a punch and perk level. Oh no, this is bad. Oh, Do that. Alright, that'll help. That'll help. Come on, zombies, where are we at? I keep this pistol if I have to. So if I get to pack a punch, it may be good to get my thing with Sally. Please be a good gun. Uh, good one. Such a little thing. Oh, the Black Ops 2 version. Last time I had the uh, Black Ops 1 version, it was actually pretty solid. Two for one uh, on the freak Death machine. I gotta keep an eye on my time because as soon as it gets to two minutes, I think, or two minutes thirty seconds. Somewhere in there, the water starts showing up, and it is it's basically the equivalent of taking zombie hits. It will down me instantly, and it will be bad. It is all sorts of bad. Was that PSG one? This ain't gonna do much. Pizza. Get one more box hit in. Come on. Later, Gator. Alright, nice. Get that gun off the wall later. Oh, no, there's the water run! Oh, come on, man. Having no warning is... It sucks. Especially because it does so much damage. Oh, I'm surprised I didn't die there. I was right, right there where it was going to kill me. So, uh, it's a good thing I bought Quirk Revive, and well, I'm not getting it back now. <laughs> just like just like last time. Actually, I think the last time, or the last play of it, I, uh, I got up further, and then I slid off into the water and died, and managed to get back out of it before it killed me again. This is the Black Ops 2 version of the Galil. That's interesting. Two versions of the Galil in the same map. Basically, now what I gotta do is just build points however possible. And I just need to get through these doors and get up there to pack a punch. And then I need to try to buy the hammer off the wall and upgrade it before I'm not able to. I'm not sure if I need stamina. I know stamina up right there. I don't think it's necessary. Really. Try to save points where I can. Not buy perks I don't need. Might skip out on elemental pop. I know that sounds crazy, but... That's a 6,000 point perk. And it doesn't give me points. So... The, the, key to this is make as many points as possible and try to get as much ammo as possible because when I get up to the the top at the viable there is no gun and the water continues to rise until death which 
is rough. <laughs> Most maps really have this. It does stop at some point. But once you make it to the top, it's like, you know, all right, that's it. You're at the top. No more perks or something. But this one's like, nope. You got like 30 minutes to beat this map and you're dead. <laughs> Just kind of interesting. Not a lot of maps do that where the viable ending or just survival gets limited by something or time-based things. Like, I mean, obviously, MWZ is fully time-based. You get one hour max to play plus an extra 15 if you go to the Dark Acer. 20 minutes, maybe. I can't remember. I think it's 15 or 20. And the points are kind of hard to get on this map for some reason. It's like certain things don't give you many points. Alright, you guys are still spawning. Chuck out my grenades here real quick. Try to kill them in the water. Let's see, I think I can open this. That'll be okay. Yeah, see, there's water there that'll slide you right back off into the deep water, and that'll kill you instantly. Or, not instantly, but it's guaranteed death, because you can't make it back out. Um, just nothing you can do about it. So, I will skip out on stamina up and elemental pop. Try to save some points. I think stamina up may be actually more useful than the elemental pop, but still, I'm going to save the points because I'm going to need 75,000 to beat the map. And if I get to a point where I can't buy ammo or don't have enough ammo to get the points, well, I'm, I'm dead. Oh. oh, crap. Oh, crap. That got, ooh, that got up there fast. <laughs> Almost died right there. See if I can slow these guys down. Death machine. Ooh, instant kill. That would actually be good. Time to spread the joy. Oh man, double points. Can I get it, please? Come and get it, rock Like I said, points is very important in this one. And I'm gonna have to move soon because I'm getting. I'm going to be in trouble if I get up here and I, I fumble something and can't get past it in time. Ugh. So can I get the points off that? Yes. Yes, I can. So there's an MP40. Honestly, just go ahead and get on up here. Oh, these are scary. So I have a speed cola. Definitely want it. I can't get the points off of it. That's scary, because I think it's a leap of faith sort of deal. Alright, so, jug, buy. Double tap, buy. Now, once I kill all these zombies, they'll start spawning over here. I should keep the glue or upgrade the AUG again. Last time I had the Scar H, which had good ammo, good power, but that was a box hit, and box is out of the question at this point. Death Machine? Samo? Nice. This is what I've been waiting for. <laughs> Try to get rid of the ones underneath real quick. They all spawn up here and just break the points in. Get out of my way! I'm coming through. Now, I think once I start opening up to the hammer, it does open another spawn eventually. So I've got to be mindful of that as well. At this point, I can literally just shoot at this hole through until that water basically gets here. Still a few stragglers from below. 
on Zandas. That double points is crucial. I don't want to run on that, honestly, because I feel like that's a... Look, Tommy, point blank, and it was not registered on a single hit. Death machine. It makes a noise like one big long burp. <laughs> Spawn camp the zombies now? <laughs> Try to figure out where I can get the maximum amount of points on these guys. Actually, actually, I can skip on Widow's Wine. Pizza! Black your ass! What is it? Widow's Wine? I don't know if Flopper would be even useful, honestly. The perks I have now are probably the best. I think it was Electric Cherry, too. Not even a warrior with it, though. Interesting thing that he didn't include Mule Kick in this map. At least I didn't find it. Get out of my way! I'm coming through! And that's done. Where's that water at? Ooh, it's about halfway to me. Go ahead and waste the oil. Go buy that hammer here in a second and pack a punch it. Uh, get low on thunder plugs. All right, go pack, not pack punch. That's three thousand. There's a spawner in that corner. What was this one? Who's who? Don't need it. Ah, I forgot. I opened it before I jumped. Pizza. Well, that, that was pretty Light awesome. Saves me from uh, having to deal with zombies. So that's. I'll see that about got me right there. But these suck. Who's in charge of giving me bullets? Oh, it's me. Okay, right, let's get these Never zombies mind. down here. Pizza! This is what I've been waiting for. Pretty sure they'll spawn me. Uh, they Are you touching me? No, you ain't touching me. Void the nuke. I want to maximize my double points. Try to burn the all up and get it back punched. All right, never mind, because it's just going to give me a max ammo. Have to run circle strategies. I've been here before and I've come through it before. Insta? Pizza! That'll make it easier on my bum hit. Can you see that? Magnificent! Go ahead and upgrade it all okay. while I've got a chance Later, to. Gator. Oh, a death machine, that'll be I'ma call you clutch. Pizza! Great freak! See if I can get up there with you a decent no amount of points. That will be great because then I won't have to worry about the ammo situation and the water basically just ending the game for me. Keep up, kids, keep up! Alright, a little hammer time. Kind of regret not getting stamina up because I do feel like I'm definitely slower with the hammer. Right. Double points? Pizza. Absolutely. Two for one on the freak -alos. Definitely want the double points. Oh. 
and then the next nuke I get, we'll upgrade and we'll move up to where the hammer is. Just pouring points by it. Hopefully that'll get me where I need to be. Okay. Stu! Let me some right. bullets, I'm running low! Alright, not exactly what I wanted, but... Oh, it ought to be built to drive by that. Duh! Forget about this sometimes. Probably a bad idea. Because this is not the good death machine. This is the Black Ops 1 type death machine. That the damage starts to really suck after about round 25. Just really waiting for that nuke. Hopefully I get it soon before that water gets in here. Reload. Ooh, nice to kill. Wow, that'd be cool. Whack your ass. Do -do -do -do. Zombies, you don't scare me. Messed up hitbox on some of them. I was shooting that guy in the chest and one of the hey, Experience over youth and vigor every goddamn time. Might even double pack it just to see if see if I can get an elemental on it too. Ah, thank you for your Dead wire. Pizza. Bingo. Couldn't ask for a better one. See if I can get past this spawn in the corner of doom. Some of these water things are fatally deadly. Like, just bad. Oh yeah, double points. Come on. Not sure why that zombie was like next to invincible, but all right. Alright, halfway to my goal. 75,000 points. I don't think there's any of those. Ooh, that's a bad death machine there. Yes, yeah, so that water's already up on that floor down there. If I fall now, I probably will die. Just go ahead and back it up a little bit. Yeah, that hurt. Max ammo, let's go for it. Oh, can I do it? Oh, that would that would have been death. No, you ain't touching me. <laughs> that water. Those water slides are scary. 
because they slide you so fast and you can think you cleared it but you totally didn't and it's not like there being a, a gap in the floor like where you either clear it or you don't you can partially clear it and still get slid up a little bit before you're able to move off of it that's the scary part if you're like halfway and you only partially make it and it slides you, it can still almost throw you off and give you a hard attack. We got double points. Pizza. Gotta have it. Do -do 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 -do. Don't need that, that's gonna kill my points. Wow. See, like right there, I tried to back jump over it and I about missed, and then the zombie would have almost downed me there. Oh, I'm at 66,000. Come on, let's let's get these points and get out of this joint. <laughs> me a new let's spin. Break the hammer out on them now. Almost. What is that? A max ammo? Oh, it's at double points. At this point, it may not even be worth it. Just try to beat this. Or at least get that 75,000 point door. <laughs> Pretty sure that's the ending, but you never know. Somebody can scam you like that. Two thousand more. Come on, zombie. not to be me. Sometimes it's hard to tell if they're even still alive because they're standing there, but they're actually dead. Keep up, kid. Keep up. Almost. Almost there. Come on. All right. You know what? get out of this place. This place of scariness. There we go. Alright, watch the whole video. Thank you very much. I finally beat this map. So, thank you again for watching. Catch you all in the next one.